Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Donnie Ray. In today's video, I'm showing you three quick and easy hairstyles that I do with my faux puff. For this first style, I'm just making a part down the center of my head and I kind of want to make it as straight as possible. Then you just want to bring your hair to the back of your head and secure a ponytail. Now I'm just using some regular brown gel to slick back the flyaways and all that good stuff. And I'm just brushing it out to get a little more of a controlled look. And I'm taking this band that I use and I am securing the ponytail. Now I just attach my puff. I pull the draw drawstring, but I try not to get it too tight till I give myself a headache. And I just secure that with a bobby pin and I fleek out my baby hairs. Then I pull out my little sideburns, I think they're so cute, and I just add some pizzazz to that middle part by putting some concealer on it to kind of brighten it up and make it stand out a little more. And I just kind of blend that out into my fingertip, and there you are, hairstyle number one. And for this second style, I'm just parting a box in the center of my head because that's where the twist will be. And once again, I'm just securing my ponytail and kind of brushing it up so that I don't have any flyaways. My edge control and put it along my edges and along my nape and I'm just gonna brush that out box that I made and I'm just doing a two strand crown twist around the edge of that box that I parted out and then I'm just going to secure the end with two bobby pins and a, um, a X symbol <laughs> and an X like symbol and this is just a little extra I like to pull down different strands and random areas just to give it like a cute look I think it's cute so that's why I do it and once again I'm putting on that puff and this one is actually the color 1b and 30 they have a little you know highlight action going on to jazz it up a little and I'm just parting it a little bit so that you can see the twist at the front of my hair and then I'm going back in with that edge control and fleek out my baby hairs this is totally optional. And for the last and final look, I'm getting a little bit more detailed. I'm starting out on stretched hair, of course, and just so I could get my full length, because this is for the style that I wear the most, which is the top um, puff. 
and I just make sure my hair is all detangled with my fingers and I just put some gel and some edge control all over my hair before I get ready to brush it up. So I brush and smooth with my hand and I just smooth it up into a top knot at the very top of my head. Then I take that um, scrunchie and I secure my ponytail with that. And then I put some more gel as a finishing touch just to make sure that my ponytail is nice and neat around the edges. Then I take another one so I can get that really high ponytail and I put it around to secure the ponytail. And this is the Puff in 1B from Coco by Zuri. And this is how it comes out of the pack. There's like a net over it. And it is a drawstring ponytail. And it has these two combs in it to secure it. And I just place one of the combs in the front of the pony and one of the combs in the back. And I take the drawstring and tighten it. Well, try not to pop it, but I'm just gonna tie that back. But I tighten it and I bring it around the ponytail, the base of the ponytail, and I take some bobby pins and secure that in there and then I just fluff it out. And that is basically how I get my top puff. And I take some bobby pins and I just pin it where it needs to be pinned because um, I try to like tame it a little bit. And this is totally optional. I just take some random hairs and bring it down and finger twirl it with a little bit of gel. And that is how I get my top puff. Thank you guys for making it to the end of this video. And as a token of my appreciation, I am having a mini giveaway. I'm giving away two of these big old puffs in the color 1B as seen in the last look. And there are four easy rules in order for you to win. So here they are. Number one, you must be a subscriber to my channel. Number two, you have to like and share this video. Number three, you have to leave a comment saying which style was your favorite and put your email and Instagram handle. And there's an example below. Number four, you have to follow me on Instagram at Donnie underscore Ray. That's D-O-N-I underscore R-A-Y-E. And repost the giveaway picture using the hashtag Donnie Ray giveaway. The contest will end on February 13th, and two winners will be chosen at random. That's right. Two people can win. So, you guys, make sure you enter. I love all of you guys, and thank you for watching my channel, and thank you for steadily subscribing. And I promise you guys, I will be more consistent. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you guys, and see you in the next video.